Hey, this is Dr. Karp. Welcome to my channel, the channel where my goal is for you to become your own authority in health. And today I am making a short video that a friend requested I make. And uh, I have a juicing habit, I guess you could say. I like to make one juice a day. And what's left over is a whole bunch of fibers. Uh, there's a whole lemon, a whole lot of ginger. Uh, and the lemon is with the rind and celery, carrots, a little bit of kale. Uh, and actually a little bit of fennel greens that uh, that I had made a salad with yesterday. And what I do is, uh, in addition to this, make these crackers that I'm making, is I put a little bit of two tablespoons, roughly, of flax. Then I take, uh, oh, a little bit of hemp seeds. And then I take some black sesame seeds. And I take a little bit of soy sauce, or you could use a little teriyaki sauce, make really tasty crackers, and put a little bit, probably around one tablespoon. And then we mix it up, doing this with one hand. This is really, really easy. Put this aside, mix, give it a good mix. And ideally, you would let it sit a little bit so that the flax can sort of act more as a binder, but I think this will work just fine. And you'll see how easy this is. So then I basically take it on a, if you have a parchment paper or, uh, actually parchment paper would probably be quite good if you had that. So I'm doing this with one hand. And you mat it down on surface here. Now I have a dehydrator, uh, but you could, after this is done, you can put it in a um, oven on a baking pan at the lowest setting. Or I saw someone use the heating area, the warming area, actually, the underneath of the oven, you know, that, that mysterious place the bottom that actually um, gets quite gets warm and can be used as a warmer for food but you could put it on the lowest setting in your oven and that should probably be just fine and you know what you're getting is a whole lot of fiber that is prepped you know that is cooked in a sense uh, and a dehydrator doesn't get cooked that much but makes it much more digestible and it tastes amazingly good. And you can put it and use it for a snack or if you have hummus or anything of that sort, then you can use it for that. And what I do is basically I just make long strips and you do have to sort of cut it because of the fiber. And, and then I put that just like that in the food dehydrator. And I'll let you know what that looks like in just a second. Okay, so this is what they look like. It's been around four hours and they are very crunchy, as you can see. They taste really, really good. Mmm, the um, black sesame seeds that I put in, I tried today are really, really good. So that is so easy to make. Hope you'll try it at home and uh, wish everyone a good day. Take care.